Hi, I'm Karen and this is Fave Lifestyles. Welcome everyone. Welcome to our live show. I have Vicki Draper here. She is an animal massage therapist. Vicki, hello. So good to have you here with us. Hi, it's so great to be here. Yes, and today we are going to be tapping into her knowledge and she's going to be giving us three tips on how to calm our cat or dog. But first, Vicki, I would love to hear a little bit about you and what you do. All right. Well, um, as Karen said, I'm an animal massage. Oh, here we are. We're oh, back hi. live. So sorry, gals. We're having a little troubles with our Wi-Fi, but just hang on and we will hopefully stay connected. So yes, tell us a little bit about what does an, an, an animal massage therapist? I think everyone needs to have one. Ah, yes. yes. The animals <laughs> love it. Just like you get the benefits mm -hmm. of your massages, the animals do too in their health. And it really helps with wellness and prevention. It helps with injury and recovery and you know, from injury or surgery and um, aging yep. and helping them move um, more freely and have more quality of life. Yes, and I know Vicki shared with me quickly um, on another video that there was somebody who, was it a dog that kept running out? And that was something that you could help her with. So there's yes. all kinds of problems that you have with your animal. You wouldn't necessarily think of an animal massage therapist, but Hey, contact Vicki and I bet she can, um, she might have some suggestions for you. Yeah, so tell us a little bit about more of what you provide and how people can take advantage of an animal massage therapist All right. with their pet. In addition to the animal massage, I'm also a natural born animal communicator. And so that's where I can really mm -hmm. help with the behavior and um, as well. And serious illness, because I'm also a Reiki master teacher. So combining um, the Western with the Eastern and the energetics that you know so it's a full tool set to yeah. support great and she was telling us last time too that um, you can take um, you can go in once and have your animal assessed and worked on or you have packages so there is actually something for every pet owner whatever your need is so yeah and you also work out of isn't it at um, Animal Healing Center in Redmond okay. with Dr. Larry Siegler and Dr. Lisa Rising yes Excellent. And if you are from a distance, you can um, contact Vicki too, and she can work with you. Yes, I do phone sessions, and because uh, I have international and national clients, so no matter where you're located, there is support. Excellent. And um, we aren't going to have a chance to talk about it right now, but um, we, or you have um, also products. So we will talk more about that in the comments because there is just so much to talk about today, but we want to get to the three ways to calm your pet or to calm your cat or dog. So go ahead. Yeah. Yes. All right. Well, our animals are so sensitive to us and our energies and our environment. So the more stressed you are, mm -hmm. the more stressed they're really going to be and they pick up on it. So we start yeah. with you. And the very first okay. simple thing, it's always hard to remember, but it's so simple, is pausing and taking a deep breath. Well, actually, I say three deep breaths. And so you breathe from your belly and breathe in. Oh, here we go. We're getting cold oh, now. And let it out. Yes, I need to remember to do this like whenever I get nervous or because I know my dog really picks up on it. Yes, yeah. yes. So. And so do that three times. And then um, another very calming is the center of the chest. So when you're holding them, just you know, put your hand on their chest. And depending on what angle they're you know, presenting to you, it's going to be whatever, wherever you're more comfortable. The more comfortable you are, the more comfortable it will be to them and soothing. Mm -hmm. And sometimes they're lying down and it's hard to get to the chest. So I wanted mm -hmm. to give you an easy one that you can get to pretty much all the time. And that is the bridge of the nose. And you want to do a light stroke Upwards. up, up, and follow the nose bridge up between, you know, well, their forehead that you don't see their eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> They're all fur. <laughs> yeah, so I've been actually trying these on my dog, Cortez. Um, Cortez is a Lab Sharpe mix and probably a little husky. And she's, yeah, she's been really enjoying it. You know, you should just sit there and help her relax a little bit. And she loves the attention, too. So it's really great. Well, thank you for those tips. And then you have um, something special coming up. You have a seminar I that you're promoting. I do. And it's in-depth chakra balancing for you and your animals and not... If you don't even know what a chakra is, great. You can come and learn and benefit. Okay. And um, 
it's an eight, well, it's eight classes and it's over eight months. So it's um, two times a month we're talking, we're going in depth with each chakra and removing blocks and that which is promoting optimum health. And one client, Kim, came to this for her dogs, just, you know, for preventative because they were young puppies and wanted to make sure she's okay. doing everything she can for them. And she came out, these blocks also impact, I mean, having them open really impacts your whole life. So she not only got support for herself and her animals, she got a promotion at work, a big promotion, not just, um, and she met the guy of her life. They're now engaged. <laughs> I mean, her whole life just really opened up. Oh, so these are, they, you go and you learn these techniques with your animals and you benefit as well. Yes. Yeah, that's very fun. That's her little testimonial to your to your seminar. Yeah. Excellent, excellent. And you are, um, Vicki is also an author, so many talents and uh, lots of ways for her to um, impact your life with your animal. And the book is called, I'll let you talk a little oh, bit okay. about it. Bridging True Love Connection and Healing Between You and Your Animals, because I'm really all about getting that heart connection between the two of you that's really because your animals are there and they they desire that and so it's helping you pause to be able to connect yeah. in, um, with them Excellent. and so with the chakra class this book comes with it and it's actually autographed I don't know if you can see that um so put fave f-a-v-e in the on the sign up page of where did you hear about this class and you will receive your autographed copy excellent yes and i have my autographed copy i'm so excited to uh, start reading this and help my um, relationship with my pet cortez and so where do they sign up how can they find you you go to www.healingyouranimal.com and select the classes and events tab and then scroll down and you'll see the um, chakra balancing class. Excellent, excellent. So we will have in the comments too, we'll put the link. So if you want to either sign up for the class or know more about it, if you um, need some more details about that, I'm sure that's on the event page or mm -hmm. sign up as well. So um, yeah, so Vicki, just so awesome to have somebody who works with our pets and make sure that they stay healthy and and that we have a good connection with them. That's really exciting. Yeah. So, gals, anything else you want to leave the ladies with? Um, I always want to say your animals will thank you because they're there. And if you're working and they're coming up and you're like, I've really got to focus on this deadline, they're actually helping you. You know, oh. they're like, calm down. You know, oh, it's yeah, okay. There we go. Um, and so it's things like that helping you understand your animal. You know, if you're not understanding why they're doing some of the things, you know, it's there's someone that can help you with that and just know that they're doing everything out of love oh that is good to know so we can actually have our um, pets benefit us even when we are stressed yes so that's a good thing so ladies so good to have you all visiting with us we have elizabeth and i know we had shami with us and lee hi gals good to see you today or um see your name we don't I, I wish we could see you that would be really awesome but i know we have so many people um that love their pets and this is just a really great way for you to help them if they need um yeah, a little, little something extra. So anyway, it's been fun chatting with you today at Pave Lifestyles. This is Vicki Draper with us from Healing You, Healing Your Animal. And if you have any questions, make sure you check out Vicki's Facebook page too. And uh, she'll be happy to answer your questions. So yes. thanks for visiting with us today. Thank you for having me. Yes, we'll see you next time at Pave Lifestyles.